Good morning from Anaheim. Uh, first off, apologies for the audio issues. Um, I've been trying a few different fixes and clearly it didn't fix it, it made it worse. I'm gonna try and get that sorted out today. Um, <laughs> so I'm going, going to get something that was sent to me from the UK. <clears throat> Um, these little fuzzy things. I didn't like the microphone on top. I sent that back. I tried the overcovers, the Rikodi overcovers again. That didn't quite work so well um, because I put the sticker over the microphone. So that's why the past week's videos are so sound so muffled. Um, I didn't know that was going to be an issue, and I wouldn't have done that beforehand. Like I said, I do have a buffer going and. So I hadn't even looked at the videos until like the eighth video into the muffled sound. So anyways, this morning we we're gonna meet up with a dude named JR. JR is living in a shuttle bus. Uh, he is a friend of uh, Fun For Louis. And um, we're gonna take a little tour. We're gonna say hello. And uh, we're gonna see if he's in here. Yo, good morning! Good morning, Jax. <laughs> good morning, JR, man. Oh my goodness, dude, you caught me. <laughs> yeah. I, I am a, such a mess. Oh, it's okay, man. We don't we don't have to do a full tour, but I want to come outside and yeah, say yeah, hello. Come if you... on out. Yeah, what happened is I had a very late, late night, and it was like almost 2 a.m. You know, by the time I got to bed here, it was almost 3. We're... And I came here and I just stayed all night here. Oh, oh awesome. Yeah. You, you boondocked yeah, in the yeah, parking yeah. lot? Yeah, you know what? Look look in the window what I do. Those are my little tricks what I do. I put my uh, I put a paper in there saying, a note saying, uh, I, I basically go in a restaurant to get a menu. I put it in my window so it looks like I'm a customer, right? Oh. Yeah, like that. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, my phone number's on there so I probably, probably don't show it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so here, here's what we got here. Two main concern, customer, vendor doing business here. Park, by permission, questions. And he puts a menu there. That is so sneaky. <laughs> that way it shows you went into the restaurant. So it's like, oh, he must be a customer. No one bothered me. Right. I do that quite often. Sometimes it works, sometimes it Oh, I thought you just rolled up right now. I'm sorry. Oh, no, I came last night. It was like almost 3 a.m. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. If you see here, it says two-hour parking. So <laughs> what a stealth little guy, boondogger this guy is. I'm, 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 you know, I, I, you know I, I had to live on the road and survive for survival, and so I, I was stuck in the city. So I got a Ph.D. in urban survival. <laughs> It's like we're having a little bus meetup right over here at the Motel 6. Um, he's going to bring it over a little bit closer. We're going to take some photos and hang out and stuff. And like I said, I offered him a shower. So uh, he's going to take advantage of a shower, a nice clean shower, because it sounds like he's been pretty ripe. <laughs> uh, guys, I got to scoot on over to VidCon. Uh, Jeff is going to hold down the fort here. He's going to take advantage of the air conditioning. Uh, as you've noticed, the audio is a little bit different. I apologize for that. Um, so, anyways, high five. Yeah, thanks so much, Jack. You're for, welcome. For your hospitality. Man, really appreciate anytime. it. Anytime. And we're going to do like, I want to talk to you more about what you do and stuff like that when I come yeah. back. This is the Road Warrior Hospitality. Thanks so much. <laughs> you got it, man. I'll see you soon. All right, All right let's go to VidCon. Back at VidCon, we're going to head over and see uh, Josh and Louie. Uh, they have a panel, a Live the Adventure panel. Um, I forget what the details, what the fine print on it said, but it's basically about kind of how to turn dreams into reality uh, for like a positive impact. Um, so we're going to do that. We're going to chat to him afterwards about this, <laughs> about this road trip that I've been invited on. Um, really, really would be awesome and uh, looking forward to that. So that's going to be pretty sick. Um, <clears throat> And um, who knows, probably just gonna go, uh, you know, shake hands and kiss babies again, yet again today. So let's begin. So 
and behold, who did I run into while I was checking out Fun for Louie and the crew? The besties! The Jurgies! Oh, yeah. We're just gonna yeah. mouth with us. Like, We're just gonna pop up stuff. everywhere. I, uh, seriously. What, well, see, the secret is, or I should say, the, uh, the thing with these guys is once you say hi, they kind of just follow you around and then <laughs> you can't get rid of them. So true. <laughs> like leeches. Yeah, so um, I might be heading to Utah <gasps> after oh. Tahoe. Yeah? So nice. I will hit you guys up and see what you're up okay. to, but I'm still floating around so I can't Are oh, you going to Tahoe with them? Yeah. That's sweet. That's yeah. Sweet. That's cool. Yeah. I know, it was pretty, pretty sweet invite. So if I do head east, I will you hit you guys come. up. Do it. If I see yeah. a post or a we'll vlog of you in Utah. <laughs> yeah. and Witnesses. You're not. Um, we're gonna go do a belated bus tour. Um, yes, I'm we've been talking. We've been talking about this now for a couple days. We all been kind of hanging out, bumping into each other in all these different places. Mm -hmm. So uh, the last thing on the list. This is the last day of VidCon, pretty much. So we're just gonna walk across the street. I'm gonna use all that in my vlog. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's like tri triple vlog. So, anyways, we're gonna go. I'm gonna go show him the bus for the first time. Yo, I'm Jermaine. My channel is 901 Cali. I make sure any economy vlogs, travel vlogs, tips on making money, that sort of thing. Cool. Daily vlogs. I'm at vlog what 533. So check me out. Pretty much, I'll like test out different apps and vlog when I'm working the app and just let people know like how much money they're making, how much money they would make if they you know, try out this app, that sort of thing. I'm sort of like a guinea pig for different startups. A gypsy guinea pig. Yep. <laughs> hey everyone, my name is Heather, or Heather Just Create on YouTube and all the other social media platforms. Um, basically, I quit my job in marketing communications, 10-year career, and I'm documenting, thank you, my entrepreneurial journey in starting a business. So all the ins and outs on like how to do your taxes as a sole proprietor to I am 32 and still single, and I have to manage that too, so. I'm with Paul of the Twin Sauce. Yes. And I just suggested that we tell this group of young girls that the floor is lava, because apparently that's like a thing. Right, which yes. I'm, so, I'm so old, I just don't, I don't understand any of this crap, so I'm just gonna tell them that yeah. and be like, okay, so we're crazy. just gonna top secret sneak up on them. Okay, guys, uh, the floor is lava! Oh go, 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 go! What? Go, 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 go. what? <laughs> I'm out, I'm out, bro. Yes, you guys are. You guys are awesome. I got it. I did it. Did you see me? Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. VidCon is something else. My brain. My feet my shoulders and my neck, my voice. Oh, but my soul is full of energy and it's so full of life. This is what life is. This is hard work chasing your dreams because only you are in, ch are in charge of your own destiny. And in the case of VidCon, my success depends solely on me. I'm 100% responsible for myself for who I meet, who I talk to, who I make friends with, the kind of content I make, the improvements I make, the journey I make, not to say make too many times, but yeah, this is like, man, it's so cool to meet other like-minded people. I also was talking to several people about not having like a circle of friends who do the same thing and feeling like kind of like the odd man out sometimes. Kind of like the weirdo that's always like recording stuff or talking to the right hand. And that is a real thing. In my case, I'm by myself, so perhaps it's easier, not sure. I am back in the uh, Motel 6. Um, I'll say this is not one of the nicer ones, one of the remodeled ones. This one is in actually orange because it was, um, about $60 cheaper than the one in Anaheim. Same area, just a mile down the street. Uh, wrong side of the tracks, I think, possibly. Uh, anyways, I've been invited over to uh, Fun for Louis Hotel. Uh, gonna check out the school bus over there. Uh, the school bus formerly known as Expedition Happiness. I believe now it is called the uh, Happiness Bus. Uh, so looking forward to uh, checking it out and meeting the crew. That bus 
is freaking awesome, by the way. Uh, I've been keeping up with it ever since it uh, hit Instagram. Holy crap. It's, it's, it's so weird to be in something that I've seen yeah. in so many pictures. Yeah, it's just so beautiful, <laughs> it really is. Jeez, my goodness, they did an incredible job here. Holy crap. Yeah. So, guys, I'm met sure you've seen the tour. I'm sure you've seen the tour. Later. I've seen everything. <laughs> I've seen the Facebook video, everything. Yeah. Um, just over here with Louie checking out the happiness bus, yeah. as it is now called. Um, I must say, it is just as beautiful as all the pictures. Holy mackerel! I mean, even this wood here, like. This it's all is nice. It's like a palette. Those are all palettes. Yeah, yeah. I saw like some of the videos of them like making everything. Yeah, you probably know this more about it than me. <laughs> yeah, I I might actually. A little bit of their, their kind of conversion, but yeah, no, I, I was I was following along the build for a while because I was like, oh, cool, some other people doing, um, you know, documenting a, a school bus build like me. Yeah. You know, so um, I think they may have beat me though. <laughs> this is so nice. It's yeah, crazy. No, it's, it's, uh, I feel so lucky to have managed to get a hold of it. It's incredible. Incredible. See, yeah, see, this is what people complain about is like mine's reversed with like the, the bench, so it's hard to see out the front window. But it's also a bit different layout. This is like yeah. full school bus, and mine's like a van front end, so it's kind of hard to see. This is nice, though. Mm. Good score, bro. Yeah, Good man. score. Thanks. <laughs> So we've been hanging for a bit uh, with two very cool guys, actually security from VidCon. There was a video that went viral and unfortunately somebody chose to disrespect these guys in the worst of ways. So we're over here chilling and we are getting everybody to follow these guys and it's been amazing. And what are you guys' Instagram accounts that everybody's following? I'm DJOES, DJOES, underscore the underscore kids. Mine's is super underscore Sergio underscore 18. So we're the underscore brothers. Sweet. Well, what makes it kind of crazy is that we've told a couple fans is that he's my brother-in-law. So I'm with his sister. So it's kind of yeah. ironic that we both came out in the video. Like, yeah. it wasn't planned. Like, it could have been any other security guard next to me. But it, it was my brother-in-law. How, how many uh, followers did you have earlier today? I had 450 followers, maybe friends, high school friends, people that I grew up with, and now I'm at, what, like 19,000? 19,000, no, no. because of... And that's from like 6 p.m., I reckon. Yes. yes. Like 5 or 6 p.m., yes. so in the last six hours. Yeah. Look at 19.1k followers. <laughs> That's amazing. And it's because, did you start this whole thing off, Louis? Yeah, you started actually, the whole video yeah, yeah. and everything and posted oh, everything? So I think a few other people were like, there's already Reached some people on Twitter yeah. and stuff. But it was when I was in the elevator earlier today and I and I was t chatting to someone and I was talking about the video and I suddenly it was like a, a light bulb thing. I was like, I was like, it'd be such a good message to, sell, to like try and get these guys more followers. Yeah. Because this kid puts all his values in the followers. Yeah. Right. And it's like to switch it around and be like, oh, well, if you think it followers are valuable, then like we could get more followers. So. <laughs> and apparently it's hit the news. Is that what you said? Well, the, the original video hit the news, but I feel like this will hit the news probably because it's such a good movement. It's all the people that, that want to support you guys. This yeah, is such a good... We... It's just like, in a way, it's, ju it's just um, a symbolic thing, right? For me... It's symbolic for anyone around the world that can just follow you. It yeah. shows you support to you. Yeah. All, the, like, all the comments, there's like thousands of comments on your People Instagram. People calling us yeah. beautiful, telling us that we're not ugly, that yeah. doesn't matter what you say. <laughs> like, dude, like we just like the only thing we want to come out from it and preach from it is like equality. Yeah, yeah. we're all and equal. No bullying. And yeah. no bullying. And yeah. because as long as everybody is equal, because we're, we're all just equally. one race, and that is the human race. That's you know? true. That's right. That's true. Everyone's equal. There shouldn't be really there any shouldn't be bullying. Color. There shouldn't yeah, be yeah. yeah. Shouldn't be. yeah. So like, I don't know. People are just absolutely. They, they have egos, and then they let it get to mm -hmm. them. But I mean, everyone has one, you know. Like, yeah. I'm, I have one. Like, it gets to me sometimes. You know, I can't say it doesn't, because you know. It does. Yeah, we all make like, mistakes. Yeah, you know, movies. like everyone. Yeah. Everybody. It was. Just, <laughs> it was. Uh, I was more all shocked by the support and the love and how everyone's acting about it and it's just cool like we I never thought I would become noticed for being nice yeah you know like for being able to put up with something like that like it wasn't my intentions to like it was just beautiful the way it happened and we didn't plan this yeah you know, like this was just a 
the word act of God. Somebody, <laughs> somebody was looking out for us. Yeah, and, definitely. And they came out today. Yeah, the message is we all have a choice. Our words, our thoughts, everything. You can choose to be positive. You can choose to be negative. And it is contagious. Your negative words are contagious. Your positive words are contagious. And this is a perfect example of what positivity can do to a negative situation. So thank you, Louis, for posting that, and everybody else who posted stuff everybody, for these guys. Thank everybody, yeah. everybody. Cool. First time on the boosted. Jax is giving this a go. How do you work this? So hold the trigger in, and then roll forward just slowly on that. Hold the trigger in, and then roll that forward, and that goes forward, and then roll back to go to break. <laughs> He's going for it. Yeah, that sounds like old man. <laughs> Woohoo! I guess he's longboarded before. Yeah. Nope, <laughs> so. Yeah, because that was the first time I got on a longboard in a long time. I like this. It's like you don't even have to kick. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, he is so good at Venice Beach. Yeah. I'm really cool. I have a cruiser board. <laughs> Dude, this, this past uh, winter, it was uh, me and Whoa, Louis. The breaking uh, part. Oh, yeah. I had, Whoa. I had the cruiser board. That's, had that's something. Boards. How did you find it? That is amazing. <laughs> that's my first like electric skateboard <laughs> session ever. <laughs> yeah, like it's just a little weird because like, I'm not kicking. Yeah. yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Oh man, that is so awesome! Thank you so much! <laughs> That's so rad! Yeah, so we just had Joe do a little art on the side of the bus. My aunt is uh, and has been writing a book for a long time. Native American book, by the way. And uh, it is called Hidden Spirit. Hidden Spirit.